Hey all, this is Puckhead, and it's been a while since we updated the video on coaching codes. So, and we've made a lot of improvements. So I just want to go there, so just coachingcodes.com, and uh, update the video, show you the updates, and also answer a lot of the questions that I've gotten from our forums. So the first thing I mentioned is forums, right? I've replaced the forums now, are way down here at the bottom. Um, you can log in with Facebook, and if you no notice any errors, you see any links you want, go ahead and update us on the forums. Here it's telling you, like, if you do like the site, there's a couple things you could do is like us on Facebook. Um, that's good for a couple different reasons, you know. It just gives notoriety out there and tells other people that uh, this is a good tool to be using. So, um, by all means, please uh, share the love. And then also you can make donations. It takes up a lot of time and effort to do this. So uh, perhaps consider donating if it's something that you use regularly. Okay, so the thing, first thing you should notice is the page is a lot shorter now. Like takes up less space and therefore also better for mobile, mobile devices. So let's go all the way to the top here. Um, we just went right to coachingcodes.com. If you do that, and again, here's the old video. We'll update it with this new video. So you'll see this new video right there. Anywho, um, this this website also um, coaching tools is just showing that coaching codes is a is a small part of a bigger um, tool system called Coach Tools, and these are actually twelve different tools that we've made and and support somewhat um, <laughs> that'll help you do your coaching business. It's just stuff I've needed, so stuff that uh, we want to share as well. All right, and I could do another video on each one of those individual subjects, I suppose. Okay, so now we're back here at Coaching Codes. So what do we want to show? Um, first off the bat, when we go to Coaching Codes just by typing it in, notice that you have Coaching Codes and Coaching Codes Canada. Let me try to up, um, open that one up. Notice the thing that we're trying to accomplish here is the background there is a Canadian Beachbody flag, and with the U.S. site, it's a U.S. Beachbody flag, and that way hopefully you can keep the two um, separately. Um, I don't get the opportunity to update the Canadian one quite as much as I do the US and I use the US so um, the um, updates might delay or lag a little bit over there. Alright so where are we at? So you notice if you come here it's automatically set up with um, some different coach IDs. So I have to put some numbers in here and I've been asked that question before in the forums. Why don't you just leave this all blank? Well if I leave it blank I'm not able to test it. So I put in a coach number that works for me, one that I use all the time. Um, and so that's there. But notice now if you come up here and you're one of our diamond coaches, let's say today we want to be... I like Pam's. Where's Pam? Well, let's be a... Why well, not? Pam's is good because she has a domain name. So we click on Pam's picture here. We come down, um, one of our diamond coaches, and because we did that, notice that puts in her coach number, her screen name, her domain name, and her extension. Now right off the bat, these links on the left-hand side over here did not update. But as I click on the individual tabs, it's going to update the rest of the page. And if that doesn't ever work, click down here on this button to update the page. Now, as soon as we've done that, notice that we've got these new links down here that are just basically test links. If you've got your data is over here and your data also shows up in the coach number, the screen name, the screen name and the email, and also down here with your domain name and extension, then the rest of the page should be okay. So this is kind of like a sanity check. Again, please like us on Facebook. Um, here's a warning. Um, everything's based upon your screen name, your coach number, always test the links you know if you're gonna put this in email test them out before you send them um, so that you know they work a lot of people ask me about the short subdomain links and if I look here in one of these things I've got these short subdomains on the left hand side shop free club these are just recommended subdomains that I I include because these are the ones I use so if anybody ever wants to you know go to my shop tab I know off the top of my head is just shop.puckhead.org and every time you update your domain name, you'll see these suggestions update. In order to make these subdomains work, you have to go to the short subdomain link thing and set that up at your domain provider. And then here is another um, link to the information that Beachbody shows you how to make these links. So if there's ever a link that's missing, 
go ahead and click right there in that tab and uh, you know we give you all the tools that you need to you know make that link yourself all right so back to coaching codes down here at the links so we've described both of those now some people had complained that this email didn't work before so I've adjusted that if you click the button here it's gonna bring up a website showing you um, who it's mailing to and then also my screen will update here it opens your email provider and I have it open it's just on a other screen over there it's not coming uh, through for some reason but you can see that it opens your email provider and actually sends out an email to the same the same address that you see up here at the top of the page so this is going to her screen name at beachbodycoach.com which is your default email address from Beachbody if you haven't set that up yet go back and make sure you set that up all right so now we get to the bulk of the material here <laughs> And if you notice before, like Coaching Codes just had this big long list of links, and if you were only looking for challenge packs, like the rest just got in your way. There was a jump thing over on the top right, but it wasn't very easy to use. <clears throat> so now we've made it a little bit easier and hopefully more mobile friendly. So um, the first tab is your default coaching pages. <clears throat> Excuse me, you've got four free pages. You know, your um, profile page, coach sales page, Shakeology page, and ultimate reset page. And I just like to test this one in particular, your um, Beachbody profile page. So we click that, it goes right here and it shows you all the information um, based upon your screen name. So if you see teambeachbodycoach.com uh, screen name, it goes right to there. Then we've got the coach sales page, Shakeology page. Now notice when we open up some of these tabs, some automatically opens. And these are the ones I think you use a lot, shop, free membership, club membership. Notice that club membership is also the way to get Beachbody on demand now. So that's going to become an important link to use. Uh, coach upgrade page. Some people have asked questions about that. The upgrade page is the one that takes you through and shows you all these videos and extra information. I've also got another tab on there that's just become a coach which should go straight to the uh, coach application as soon as you choose your country here. Now whenever you're testing those links, make sure come down and look at this coach referral and then it's got your name in. You know, I test all these links before I send them out to my clients and don't ever come back and blame coaching codes or you know Beachbody for the mistake. You know, make sure it's showing up in your links. Um, with that being said, one of the first questions that we always get is when you're using challenge packs, Beachbody challenge, um, well this is a new feature we added, challenge group guides. So um, Beachbody's done all these great guides, all these trainers sat in front of a camera forever. Let's go to Sagi. And each week that you're running a challenge group, you can send out um, one of these challenge group guides from the actual trainer to your clients. And the clients really appreciate that. So notice that Pam's web page comes up here in the background. And this is Sagi with week nine. Hey, beast giving you some tips on you know what to do for that particular week. Also, if you click here and share this link, this is gonna be the same link that we just gave you, but it gives you another way to do it or copy it directly to Facebook and Twitter. So that's the Beachbody Challenge Group Guides, and notice that we've done quite a few of those here listed, and the individual instructor's name automatically opens, opens and then you need to jump to the individual programs that you want. But if you're not looking at Challenge Group Guides, just close that tab up. Now, but challenge packs are ones that most people always are going to be going to. These are the links that most people ask me about. So if you jump to challenge pack links, um, we've got all challenge packs, March promotions, and the individual sales for this month. Now, I automatically open up that tab because that's what most people is try are selling each month is the individual promotions. But we also have links to all the individual challenge packs here based upon... Oh, the price that they are. Um, again, another question that's going to come up a lot is where is the challenge pack for the um, Beachbody On Demand, BOD for short. And I'm listing it here as the Club and Shakeology Challenge Pack. Now, these are the same names that I get right out of the back office of the shop tab, so I'm not modifying those. 
um, and right here it shows you club and challenge pack now if you click on one of the links in the challenge pack links and the challenge pack doesn't come up or you don't see challenge packs listed over here on the left this is the number one question I get asked is why isn't the challenge pack links working well it's probably because you're still signing as a coach and coaches don't have the option to buy challenge packs because they're such a good deal you know coaches would just buy them over and over and over but um so go ahead and log out of your Beachbody account and then you'll notice that the challenge pack then becomes available and you want to be testing these links as a client anyway to make sure all the links work so that takes you through all of the challenge pack links and uh, everything else down here is pretty self-explanatory um, I guess the new thing other new thing is just under fitness programs we've listed all the fitness programs here by individual trainers I've even got Tanya and um, She's only got one little program, but that's awesome. Um, so if you're looking for a P90X product, just search here under Tony Horton, and you'll find the individual product that you need. Now, since we've already clicked on one of these links, uh, let's go to Sagi. If I come down here and click first on Body Beast, notice this link starts with teambeachbody.com. If I click first on Body Beast, this is going to take me right to where I can go buy Body Beast, add to cart, check out. Notice I'm currently a guest. I come down here I make sure that my coach name sh shows up or in this case Pam's um, that's how you're testing your links now as soon as a customer has actually come to Beachbody with any one of these links that is um, <clears throat> assigned to you using your coach number then you then have the ability to use the rest of the links and somehow here I've lost my page so let's just go ahead and go back to coaching codes you then have the ability to use some of these other more advanced links that I've created so what we have down here let's go back to fitness programs we're looking at Sagi and we clicked on body beast now this one starts with teambeachbody.com you have to click one of these links first so that it has a coach number assigned to it because notice this link up here does not have a coach number but the cool thing about this link is it allows us to customize um, the links that we send so if I want to see all Sagi products I can click right here and this is going to show me all the individual products that Sagi sells based upon these tags that are shown on the right so it searches for trainer and Sagi and then it has all of his individual links here now if I add to cart it's still going to work and assign this to um, me and I think it's set up for my dad right now Oops, it's still Pam because we already logged in once as Pam. Hey, that's that's maybe a good thing to point out. Um, we're currently logged in as my dad, but when we go back to Beachbody, because we're using this link that doesn't have a coach number in it, Pam would have gotten that sale. So that's why I'm saying if you want to use these generic links that show all fitness programs or all Sagi's products or you know all Tony's products, you have to make sure that they're clicking on a, a link with your code first and then you can refer them to this. So you might include two links in an email, click this one, then that one. Um, I'm not sure how to do it, but for me it really helps to be able to jump to all Tony Horton's products here and then search through those instead of looking through all the different fitness programs. That's why we included them. Probably need to do a, some sort of a warning there to make sure everybody's okay with that. All right, so I want to tell you now um, and I also have all challenge packs so I think this is a nice one another nice one is all March promotions so you can click here one spot and you'll see what all the promotions are for the month and I think that'll really help um, you know not only myself but all coaches when they go to this alright so last thing I want to show you is if you just came with a generic link coachingcodes.com it's going to try to identify you and if it does not identify you it's going to give you this thing enter your coach number to configure the links for you or your clients and it gives you an example of one of these so if I copy that example which I've made for myself so it's easy um, and I just go back up here to the top paste in that new link um, it's going to customize this page for me so let me go over what this customization does first of all you just see the default link coaching codes then we've got this ID number, which is your coach ID, 91947. Then a SN for screen name, which is my screen name. DOM is domain name for Puckhead, and EXT is extension for my domain's extension. Now I want to use that link. And you know what? Go ahead and bookmark this link. So every time you come to Coach's Codes, you're going to have that customized link for you. 
Um, every time I use this link now, I don't have to push any of these buttons. I don't have to type in any information. I just go down and all my information is here. I don't even have to click on the individual tabs. It's automatically updated. I see my updated information here. And if we go up just a little bit further, I'm sorry, I'm jumping around here. It says, welcome coach and your coach number and then your screen name. So I think this is a better way to use coaching codes. And in fact, you could send out this link to your clients and then they can look through the entire catalog and decide what's best for them. All right, so now that we're here, just I think one more thing I want to talk about. Um, and what's another thing we should go over? Yeah. Let's go to video links. Um, I've kind of sectioned off these video links a little bit better here. So um, have you used the one-on-one -on -one products before? These are a bunch of great um, demonstration videos from each one of the one-on-ones. So I've had problems in the past, and that's why I've made the background a little image a little bit lighter if you try to copy this like see the copy goes all over the place and then I come back and I try to just copy from this side and I get it always screws up so what we've tried to do here now is um by highlighting these links with yellow whenever you see the link you want now I can tell them I'm on butt and belly I can right click and just say copy that link now when I go up to any individual page here, or website, or email, or Facebook, I paste in that link, and um, it's much easier to do that copy process. So hopefully that helps. Um, one last thing, I guess mostly for the team, so if you're not a teammate here, you can kind of cut off. But up here on the top, we've listed um, all of our team's different websites. And this is a great place for any of those team members to jump in. So Team Sparty is a great team um, with the Fit Union. So I just click here, open this link in a new tab. It's going to take me right to Facebook here for the Team Sparty page. So this is a great place for um, you know all of our teammates to come to connect to that. Now we do we do monitor the members and make sure everybody's a member. So there's, don't go adding all the teams, but if you're a teammate, this is a great way to get to the other teams within the uh, overall fit union. All right, um, I think that's, that covers just about everything. And again, um, it's just been a while since we did one of these videos, and there's been a lot of extra features, so I hope the features help. I hope it's easier to use. I hope it works on all the different mobile platforms out there. And, uh, you know, when, when there is an issue, please, you know, use the forums here at the bottom of the page to let us know about it. And remember, um, mostly it's just one guy or maybe me and an assistant working on these. So sometimes things don't get updated quite as quickly as we would always like. Um, but thanks for your patience. And again, I hope it's a great tool that everybody continues to use. Um, if it's a tool you use a lot and you see me at Summit, you know, just stop by and say hi. It's like, hey, Jason, I appreciate the coaching codes. I use it all the time. This is what it helps for. And I always enjoy hearing those stories. All right. Thanks, everybody.